I did set plan, would like to set the scene. I feel like everybody knows the story, but that may not be true. So, this is the story of David and Goliath, and we begin, we are in the hills, the barren hills of Israel, and um, the commander and sentries are keeping watch because the Philistines, the enemies, Goliath is their secret weapon. The Philistines have been taunting them. And that's where we enter the story. David. David, get your head down. Status report! The 
Try to stop, sir. It's taking up its normal position. Okay, all clear. Why is everybody hiding? Guys, I want you to meet my little run to my brother, a shepherd and part-time singer for the king. What are you doing here, David? Dad sent me with some food for you. Look, why don't you go back and do a ditty for King Saul? This is a spot for real soldiers. Yeah. Well, I don't get why everybody is so scared. It's the enemy secret weapon, Goliath the Gap. He comes out every day and shouts, insult says. And then challenges us to fight him one on one. Well, why don't you? Are you kidding? Nobody can fight him. Yeah, you don't know anything about military stuff. Where have you been? Watching sheep? Well, the man's a monster. He looked like he fell out of an ugly tree. Yeah, and hit every branch on the way down. You can sit 
on a maggot and swing your legs. Yet again, I say to you, you're so stupid, you could get one of my halt chariot. <laughs> and a third time, I declare, you are so weak, you could not fight your way out of a wet parchment bag. When I have worked my will upon you, you will look so you slept up without a pale face down. <laughs> In the name of the gods of the Philistines, Dagon, Astrop, and Beelzebub, I hereby curse you. <laughs> this is terrible. They're defying the army of God. Somebody ought to answer him. Yeah, but who's going to do it? Listen, if somebody killed Goliath, wouldn't King Saul reward him? Huh, he's right. The king would probably give you any riches. Even better, he'd probably never have to pay taxes again. Hey. Then, the king might even give his daughter to get married. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Which daughter? The youngest one, Michael. Oh. Princess Michael? I know her. She's a friend of mine. Is that right? No, really. I see the one at the palace. You don't all know it all. You can't fool me. What do you mean? I know why you're really here. You just want to see a battle. What did I say? All I said was somebody ought to teach his Goliath a lesson. Am I right? Yeah. yeah. We've had enough of that Philistine trash talk. Yeah. It's an outrage. Yeah. We're not going to take it anymore. Yeah! So who's going to stand up and do it? I'm kind of busy. It's not my job. I have a previous commitment. What kind of excuses are those? What? You want better ones? Why didn't you say so?
Evan. I'll fight Goliath. <laughs> You're gonna fight him? You've got to be kidding me. No, I'm serious. Tell the king he can send me. Hello? Knock, knock. Who's there? Goliath. Goliath, who? Goliath down in the field and watch your sheep. <laughs> He's right, kid. Nobody's gonna tell the king a hair pretty idea like that. Why not? Look at you. Goliath is nine feet tall. You're small enough to post for trophies. You're so short, you gotta use a ladder to lace up your sandals. You're so short, you gotta cuff your underwear. Hey! Leave him alone! At least he has the courage to speak up. Who are you? I'm a friend. Ooh, I'm afraid. Hey, didn't you know that's the king's daughter? Princess Michael? Like I said, I'm afraid I haven't made your acquaintance. Tell a long, beautiful princess, fairest of all women. Your nose like a cedar of Lebanon. Your lips like a pomegranate cut open. Your neck please, like Please, please try not to grovel on my toenails. So sorry, your highness. I had no idea. Somehow, I'm not surprised. Michael, what are you doing? I'm sticking up for you. Now listen up, all you great big heroes. I know you think David's a joke. But you don't know him like I do. When my father's having one of his temper tantrums, David's the only one that can calm him down. Everybody else runs off, but David stays and plays music. Please, Michael, you don't have to offend me. I want to. That's what friends are for. So next time you're all running here, look around to see who's still standing tall. You might be surprised. Are you okay? I don't know. That was a little embarrassing. Hey, if your friends can't say good things about you, who can? I guess you're right. Besides, you do the same to me. Well... Come on! You know you would. All right, I guess you're right. So next time, you'll be there for me. This was just my turn. Thanks. Don't mention it. So, you don't think I'm crazy? You're standing up for God, right? Yeah. Well, then crazy or not, I'm right here with you.
something to tell the king? I'm ready to play polite. Are you sure? I am now. I tell myself, but I don't think you'd listen. Don't worry, I'll do it. Oh, 
needs your virus. Let me be the one to fight the giant. And what if he kills you? If God is saving you from lions and bears, I don't even save you from the Philistine. What do you say, Michael? You believe this boy? I'm afraid for him, Father, but I know God's with him. All right, David, I'll let you go. Under one condition. Yes, Your Highness. You have to wear my armor to protect yourself. Just because God's on your side doesn't mean you can't use a little extra insurance. Commander! Yes, sir! Get the shepherd ready for battle! Bring out the king's armor! All right. 
take one from my family. I guess I was a little hard on you, kid. You got this. Thanks, brother. I'll take one from Shepard. Thanks for keeping watch, David. And one from my kid. Stand up, son. We've got a job to do. Yes, Your Highness. You sure you don't want that on? I'm sure. Just one more son. This one I choose in the name of Yahweh, who is our friend, our family, our shepherd, and our king. Thank <laughs> you. 
dare stand for the awesome challenge of the Philistine army and their mighty champion, Ayu, a boy. You're sending us a boy? <laughs> Very well then, prepare to meet Goliath. Not this day. This day the battle is the Lord's. 